Alright, so how's it going people? I hope you all are doing well. Now, another day, another terrible human being in the society. Y you know, a uh, terrible human being. That's a kinda harsh word, Nikki. Yes, it is. But that's what this person really is. Now, what I saw today while scrolling through Twitter just ruined my day. So I found this video of a woman who jumps on people's legs, kisses them right in front of their girlfriend. This is basically sexual assault. Out of all the ways you could get clouded in, you decided to take the goddamn sexual assault way. I mean, my guy was just casually sitting there with his girlfriend. Then you just come and interrupt them by sitting on his arm and kiss him. His girlfriend was trying to get her off him right which is probably the most common reaction possible she should be put on the streets on a prison cell because that's where she belongs to I swear man, this is really just fucked up. The amount of stuff that people would do to get fame is just absolutely disgusting. Every day I just feel bad for the society, you know. And the terrible stuff really just continues. This time it's just a couple, you know, sitting there on the bench trying to look through the phone, right? Then she comes and interrupts them with a kiss. You can clearly see the girl is not having it, so is the guy. The guy's just thinking, you know, what, 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 what just happened there? You know, what was the main motivation for that, alright? Did your boyfriend leave you so you gotta find a new one? Was it just because you are a cloud-hungry person? You know, I think it's the second one. I mean, how's the guy even able to respond to that, you know? I mean, there's nowhere in the world where you'd think that a random girl would jump onto your legs, alright? While you have a girlfriend next to you. It's basically just common sense. But like, you know, it's 2021, so this type of behavior doesn't really surprise me. She does this with like two others. Like imagine if it was a guy who did that. He'll be in jail by now, you know. He'll be goddamn slammed to the ground and slammed with a baseball bat, you know. He'll be dropping the soap in the fucking shower at prison. The fucking double standards is absolutely huge, right? The man is just, you know, leaning back because he don't want the kiss, you know. He's like, sorry, nah, man, I have a wife and two kids, so please stop doing this to me. This is not acceptable. This is not how the society should be. We all know it's because it's a woman who did it and not a man. Had it be a man, he would be into jail by now. Or investigators on Twitter did a pretty fine job on finding out who this girl was. And people showed screenshots of her profile and stuff. Yeah, I think we should take a look at some of the other videos she has posted. Because, uh, they are as bad. Now, the TikToker we'll take a look at today. It's a TikToker named Polka.org. I don't know how you pronounce that. And by looking at this, oh boy. Kiss or kick. Now you got an idea on what person we're talking about. And oh boy, it's cringe. So I was browsing through her TikTok, right? And I stumbled on probably one of the worst videos ever. It's probably as bad as that one. And guess what? It has 1.6 million fucking views in this video she's just jumping on people's uh you know on people's lamps and trying to hug them right at least she didn't kiss him but it still doesn't change the fact that it's sexual harassment and she needs to really be punished for it like there's no excuse around you all right oh shit i jumped on people's legs i hope i'll get a boyfriend by now the video has copyrighted music so i i gotta fucking mute that i've had enough of claims in the past and i don't want to and to slam my ass with the C mark. The girl's just, you know, jumping on this poor guy. Like, this poor guy's in confusion. You know, it's like, uh, can you please get away? I'm, I'm, I'm pretty uncomfortable right now. And I would be too, as I got a woman on my fucking lap. Out of nowhere. This is so goddamn disrespectful. Kind of baffles me the fact that people really do this to get fame on TikTok. I mean, don't get me wrong. There's been a quite a bit of cases where people literally jumping on people and harassing people for views. But like, this is basically just the same over and over and over and again. It's starting to be a culture of idiotic people. I mean, these are people are completely different from the complete society. Like I'm telling you, these must be aliens, right? Now she proceeds to jump onto another guy and the guy rejects her, throws her onto the ground, which is very understandable. Imagine if a man did this, you know, he'll be in goddamn jail. And if I did this, my mom would disown me. She would send me to Antarctica and I'll live with the penguins having to flop my wings. If there's any girls watching this video, this is not how to score a guy. You just don't run up to them randomly and be like, oh yeah, take me, take me, I'm sitting on your lap, take me, I'm ready to ride your cock. This poor guy was just, you know, chilling with 
his homies and then just comes and interrupt them if his girlfriend's gonna go through tiktok and find the video how would you explain that to her it's not something you just can't explain at the end she does this with like two others and it genuinely makes me question the humanity think about it we breathe oxygen with these types of people which is something i don't really understand why we do like it's clearly by the mentality often that they can't even breathe for oxygen. In conclusion, she's a woman who belongs to the street and in a prison. And a woman who doesn't have any common sense whatsoever. She's a cloud hunter who probably don't deserve the fame to be honest. Like let's be real here, harassing people uh, shouldn't be something you should get a fame off. Now before I get too heated, I should probably wrap up the video now. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please do like. It will really mean a lot to me especially now when i lost 2000 brain cells after scrolling through her tiktok follow me on twitter at nicky mark eclipse for news and stuff like that and in general if you just want to communicate and only 1.4 percent of people who watch my videos are subscribed to my channel so you know uh what you're waiting for it's free at the end of the day you can always you know just change your mind and stuff so i hope you're gonna have a wonderful amazing day see you in the next video peace out love you Thank you.